What's going on guys? Welcome back to Crossout today. I've got a cool build for you. Today we're checking out this dual Vulcan machine gun minigun death race build. Now I found a I was looking for a death race vehicle. I was gonna try to build one, but then I found one in the exhibition and I tweaked it significantly to improve it quite a bit to add on the dual Vulcans and stuff like that. We've got an engine, we've got a, a, a charged radiator, we've got a, a Hazards generator in here. We've got two Vulcans Somewhat protected. We'll see how that goes and uh, this is kind of a death race build now The cool thing is is that I'm gonna start doing this like viewers decide videos for cross it like I used to do for War Thunder and so a lot of people uh, I'm gonna try to find all the all the people who suggested it and take screenshots and stuff put them up on the screen But a lot of people suggested me to make a death race build and so that's kind of what I'm doing And somebody specifically said can you make Frankenstein's car? That's got the two mini guns in the front that are on like the Mustang and the Mustangs don't really like look that great That people have made or I've tried to make one. It doesn't really look that great And so I opted on going with something like this and uh, Is this even mounted on the it doesn't even look like it's just floating there <laughs> uh, Yeah, so I opted on using something like this, offset it a little bit as much as I can. It's still, you know, got some, um, you know, issues with like where it, where it aims and stuff, but it should be okay. I'm really excited to check this out. Now, here's the problem though. I don't really have a lot of durability left on these wheels, and so I need to change these out. And so I can't keep that look, even though that's like the coolest look for it. Um, but uh, I'm gonna switch those out with something else. Hopefully, you guys enjoy this video. Thumbs up if you do. Subscribe if you're new. Let's get into it. Alright, we're on Factory, which is probably one of my favorite maps to start out with. This thing is drifting all over the place. Holy crap, my weight is all messed up, I think. I put an en another engine on in the back, a bigger engine, and swapped out that light engine. And so, I think it'll be a little bit better. It seems like it's got a little bit more a little bit more uh, speed, which is nice. Right, it doesn't look like anybody's coming this way. I've... Oh, here we go. Here's a guy. I don't usually go up here, so this is kind of new, a new place for me to go. Roll it up! Wreck him! Can we just jump off here? Oh, sweet. I gotta get that. I wish there was, like, replays. I don't know if there are, but some people get, like, crazy screenshots, and I have no idea how they do it, but if there, was re if there were replays, like, you can get, like, some sweet screenshots of things like that. Jumping off, we got a guy. Oh crap, there are so many guys right here. Dude, oh my gosh. I always get killed due to teammates. Things always happen because of teammates. It happens every match. Teammates always get in the way, doing stuff. I'm lo I lost the wheel now. Great, great. I'm basically incapacitated. Just kill, let's just kill Emily real fast. Please, can we? These things just just shred they just shred here's Oliver that radio that charged radiator like is greatly helping three kills to start the game off start the video off with that's nice like it a lot we got we're prestige level one. Oh my gosh power plant power plant's a fun map to play close such close quarters like you have to worry about like pyro launcher builds and stuff Alright, come on. Show me somebody. Sasha, I'm gonna kill you. I know that's you, Sasha. Oh, you, dude, you made a mistake, man. You made a mistake. You made a huge mistake. Everyone stick together. Let's do this. Ferron. I'm gonna go rush Sasha. She can't do anything with those... The hurricane? I think it's Hurricane Launcher. Hurricane launcher build can't do anything. Thank you so much, teammate, for screwing up that perfect little run I had there. That's perfect. Okay, Sasha's dead. Okay, here's a guy. Is that another death race build? Dude, looks like he's got a. Oh crap! Alec, you freaking stupid AI. Let's kill Alec real fast. Shave off all that crap. Stut, stut buzz. 
And at 25. Got it. And he's dead. But we have no wheel in the front, which is a problem. I'll save you, dude. I'll protect you. We got we got some health left. We can do this. This guy's dead. Got him. Oh yeah. Still living. Yeah. Guys in her base. Get off, bro! What are you drunk? You don't want me to get the kill, you wanna get it? You push me out of the way? Freaking drunk, bro. B fifty two J, that guy's got thunderbolts, I think. Yeah, this is this is how you drive right here, guys. This is how you drive. Deal five hundred thousand damage to player vehicles. What the crap, Warlord? Sick. All right, we're on Founders Canyon. Our base is already under attack. There's a couple people back here. Sasha, I think, has got the uh, missiles, if I recall correctly. So we're gonna try to see if we can flank around. Why is our? Well, I can't believe our base is being capped so much right now. I just, there's so many guys back here. Freaking Lisa. Can we take off that 100? We already lost one. Kill Lisa. Kill Lisa. Dude, we only need one, we, don't, we only need one minigun. How is she not dead yet? Seriously? How many, how much do we have to do to kill you? Lisa. Okay, s teams are still pretty balanced. Sasha's still alive. Whatever that Russian name is. Got three. Bak Bakmu. That's not a at all how you say it, obviously. So where's Sasha? With her pyro launchers. His, her, whatever. Overlooking the middle, maybe. Hopefully not. Oh, lots of action over here. Yes, there's two people. It looks like overlooking the middle, maybe. We're missing a wheel. It's making things difficult. Flipped over? One of them slipped over. Okay. Okay, one at a time here. And then we'll move on. <laughs> Sucks for these guys. I just don't wanna. Okay, we got one. Now we kill Sasha. Well, let's go for the guy who's not flipped over. Missile. Crickets. Crickets. Oh, crap. Crap. Okay, I think it's definitely proven to me now that in Crossout, having four wheels can work, but it's so much better to have six. Like, it's ridiculously better. Having six work works so much better because you don't have to worry about what happened to me in the last... Uh, I don't know what... I don't know. The clips are going to be out of order. But what happened to me in the last match was I had both... had. One of them blew off, one in the back blew off, and it was completely incapacitated me, incapacitated me, and then also, uh, you know, having two blown off in the front, that's an issue too. My point is, is that having six is definitely the way to go. It makes the most sense, and you don't have to worry about getting killed as easily, and getting knocked out of the fight, basically, so. That, those guys jumped off of there. Some man. Auto cannons! Alright, so we got a kill us for that? Alright, we're gonna get in the fight here. I like this build a lot, it's pretty cool. Yeah. Just a pretty fun build to play. I think I just really like Vulcans. They just do so well. There's Samantha. Stay out of the way. Heavy MG over here. Don't want to get hit by that thing. Shave off all everything we got. Dangerous. Guy's dead. So we get Zeno and B52J. I am a f f 
flip this guy over here. Once he stops moving. You, it, it won't allow you to flip him over until they stop moving. Got him. Okay, let's let's let it cool down a little bit here. We'll wreck him again. Yeah! Look at how much damage it does. It's insane. Hurry up! Here we go. So much damage, so quickly. So that guy got a kill. So where could he be? Okay, he's dead. Wow. Okay, that was pretty fun. That was good. That was good. That was good. That was good. Not too bad. We didn't do too bad there. Thunderous Canyon. Um, we got B52J on our team. Good Thunderbolt build guy. Um, we'll be okay in this match. I I really like this map quite a bit. I love the sun on this map too. It's always like so beautiful looking. Look at this. Look at this scenery. This perfect screenshot worthy screenshot right here. You guys don't even know. I gotta do it in game because I always forget. And then I, I'm like scrounging like, and I, I don't like, I don't like doing it from the, uh, from the, uh, like the hangar area because it's so dreary looking. This is the only map that's like actually like bright and beautiful. Everything else is dreary. Post apocalyptic world, you know. Dreary looking. Xeno man, you are always getting in like the worst positions, dude. Took out his took out, took out his uh wheels and now he's just screwed. This poor guy, I mean he's always he's always, always in bad positions. Sasha! Gonna get you, Sasha. She can't do anything. Hurricanes. He's pretty fast though, so. Gotta look out for that. Get those wheels. This is what I love about the Vulcan build. Just shaves off wheels. Yeah, you're dead. You are dead, Sasha. You just shave off parse galore. Yo, what's up, my man? Oh, no! Wow, we lost anyway. Dang it, we got three kills, though. That's not too bad. Freaking wreck, Sasha. All right, ship graveyard. Let's see what we can do here. Ship graveyard's another map that it's kind of bright and nice looking. Oh, B-52's little build there. This thing still drifts like crazy. I, f I thought I fixed the weight thing, but apparently not. Uh, th this build originally had a lot of, like, avia panels, and so I swapped on for the scavenger stuff. Just lower power score uh, for, you know, lower power score plus higher structure points, and so, you know, you get your HP up. I wanted to at least get the uh, the build over 1,000, 1K, 1K health. I almost always try to do that. It's just more balanced that way. I normally would not put these outer fenders on. I just did it for looks because they add a lot of weight and uh, they don't really like do much for you. Just try to do a little. I mean, it does a lot of damage from distance too. Two guys over here. Okay, they're all going to our base, but we're capturing the enemy base. So, I would imagine they're gonna try to come back. At least maybe one or two of them. Maybe not though. Oh, here's a guy. Swipe that kill. Whoa! <laughs> Got hit by all the friendly missiles. That was funny. We're good. We're good. Woo! Swipe that kill, too. Ah, oh, sorry, man. Sorry, main. This match is over, and we got two kills in it. Very, very fast match, that is for sure. Wow. That was over quick, but it was good. Good nonetheless. This build's so probably this build's pretty good overall. Ship graveyard. Let's see what we can do here. We're on the right side. I like being on this side. It just always seems to work out better for me when I'm on this side. I don't know why. Maybe it's just the layout of the ships. I have no idea, but either way, it's al it always goes better. Ah, this build looks so. This build looks so cool. Turn the lights on, man. Turn those lights on. Doesn't look like anybody's coming over here. There's one guy right there. See if we can do any damage to this guy since he's out in the open. He's so many machine guns! Too many! 
I love this build. It does so much damage from so far away. Oh, crap. It's so much damage. Oh, no. I've only got one. Oh, crap. Eh, I'm dead. That was a mistake. Can you just get this guy? Thank you. Okay, we got it. We got it. One kill. Better than nothing. Better than nothing. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this build. Leave your comments below telling me what you guys want to see. I'll try to make it. Hope you guys enjoy it. Thank you so much for watching. Thumbs up if you liked the video. Subscribe if you're new. Death Race build complete. See you guys in the next one.